the man, the myth, the legend. Ladies and gentlemen, it is Finding Nick. What's up, bro? That shit's so clean. I like your car now. APR, APR V3. Breakfast? Damn, G! Yeah, yeah. Breakfast. Yo, you think the Toho looks sick? For sure. That looks sick. I like the battles. That was cool. Was it? You see the big ass choking took off? This shit ain't even screwing. I got a scan. <laughs> it looks fucking stupid. Bro, that shit looks so dumb. You like it? Bro, it looks stupid. I bought this shit for nothing, bro. It looks stupid. Look at the cars broke into something. I gotta tell you this shit. Oh, bro, real quick. Does that look stupid or is this shit look cool? I mean, it's like a funny looking red. It just sticks out too damn much and you can see like the opening of the, the grill. I think it's because the, the red is off. It's like an orange. Like, yeah. If you look at the caliber, it doesn't like, they don't like go together. Damn. But I mean, if you, if you gotta, you know, if it's the B58 blow up, you gotta tow it. <laughs> don't say that. It's fun, bro. That's yeah. Really good, dude. And now, gentlemen, we have to wait for this car. We're in like 10 minutes, bro. Right? Oh, shit. As Fresh Kicks mentioned, we're gonna stake out on an on-ramp. So there's a BH2 event happening today. We're kicking it on an on-ramp, waiting for those guys to basically fly by. I need um, I need a coffee company to sponsor 3GP. That's what I need. I would love that. I will do whatever you want. I will drink a cup every episode. And we're off. We're back in Anaheim where the Origins meet was hosted. Holds like 10,000 cars. It's a big event. A lot of sponsored, a lot of sponsors showing up and stuff. I wonder how many ratchetivities will be happening today. You good? Ready? You might have to go down. Damn, this place is lit. You can't take back some things. Damn, this pink GTR is so hard. I'm down, bro. Imagine with my wheel set up, that shit will probably like say. We're on a new Beamer. I like them, bro. I'm honestly waiting for to see what the market looks like within the next like six months. They're not bad, bro, honestly. 600 horsepower uh, Lamborghini uh, Huracan twin turbo. Times fucking two. <laughs> I'll sell my GTR for that shit. Easy. We can probably come that way. Yeah. Nice, dude. Especially in the sun, bro. I seen this one in the sun before. That Daytona shit, dog. I'm already parked like right there. I'm hungry. Super hungry. We can even grab food somewhere else. But I mean, I'm down to cruise with them all. Should be pretty sick. I mean, Irvine's like fucking 10 minutes. So oh, yeah. it'd just be a nice little 10 minute mob. They're going to Newport, though. 15 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Plus some E91, you know, that dirty skunky. They got a full parachute. I need one of those. Yeah. Ready to go skydiving? Just, I don't know. Just yeah. goals. It's taking so long to get it goals. I, I, would, I would consider selling my GTR for something like this, but I need something reliable. Last time I asked you why you have a parachute. I literally just got it back like three days ago. Yeah. So 
little tricky. It gets a little tricky. My favorite super I've seen probably all year. That shit fucks. What's he pushing? I didn't hear what he said. I think like easy 900. <laughs> Sorry, you just want to make it fast, you know? So we're chilling here and waiting for MB2 and then like these kids all pop out and they're fucking challengers and taquache trucks and all that shit. And you hear them all like, shee, shee, whatever. And we're like, and then this fucking scat pack drives all the way around. Look, show right there. All the way around just to come up in front of us. And he stops right there and he like stops and I'm like, dude, he's, he's turning off traction control. This fucker's ready. So he like pulls over right here and he stops. And then my dumb ass is like, no get my cut. <laughs> First thing he did. And I was like regretting it. I was like, no, I was just kidding, boo. <laughs> you know, blame it on us. This guy always does it. I it's know. always you, bro. You always provoke everybody and then... He just needed a little push and I gave him that push. I look, you wanted to see him burn out though. That's you right there. Well, mm -hmm. not me, literally. But, you know. but, you know, I blame you. I'm gonna go on some like Lewis Hamilton, hit the corner. You know, come at you, apex Yo, shit. Don't be, don't but, be putting uh, Lewis Hamilton's name in vain like nah, that, my guy. Is, watch, watch what I'm in first place, bro. You know what happens when Lewis Hamilton gets bumped by someone and hits the wall? He ends up last. Who the fuck is Lewis Hamilton? <laughs> <laughs> We're at uh, MB2 out here in Sonoma. I got dragged to fucking come race and fucking prove a point. Chilling at home, kick my legs up, and I get the call like, yo, it's time to go to uh, MB2 and settle this. So I was like, fuck it. I ain't been here since like 2009, 2008. I was probably like 17, 18. But I've been hearing a lot of shit like Rigo's got canyon experience, Nathan's got track experience, and uh, you know, I know speed, I know apex, I know cornering. You know, I'm kind of smooth with it, you know? So I'm kind of excited because they're, they're not expecting me. I'm sure they probably said, typical things like he's a straight line this fool anthony he just knows straight line that fool don't know how to turn it's trash he just knows drag racing he just knows how to go fast straight which is totally false i got beef with everybody i'm just trying to like if look listen if anyone's in front of me and you're just like at the right angle i'm gonna bump their ass all these foods are about to be taken out, bro. I'm not even kidding. I've been waiting for this day. Junior Real, he drives crazy as fuck on the freeway, so like, yeah, it's getting a little dicey right now. But no, you know what? I'm gonna play Snip now. That way, I don't feel bad when I bump someone off the track. I see myself coming in like first, second. I might kill it. I might just land first place. I hear the top competitors being Rigo and Nathan. How like, much grip I have? Try not to like come down in speed and just like stay at the highest speed as possible. Rigo's competition, we all know that. Uh, Nathan is a question mark. And I'm gonna be first place. I'm about to clap everybody's cheeks right here, especially Rigo. Let's take a little shot, put my headphones on, zoning in. I'm kind of worried a little bit about Nathan. Uh, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on him. I'm gonna play it safe for the most part. And Mateo's dead last. <laughs> <laughs> Double's dead last. And if it's not Rigo second, I see Nathan fourth, and then Mateo dead ass last. <laughs> Mateo's gonna be last place, bro, no question. Maybe Mateo's at the end. <laughs> it's just, it, you know, boy just got his license, so, you know, it, it's just, it is what it is. Well, good afternoon. Welcome to the MB2 Raceway here in Los Angeles, California, as the drivers get ready to go out onto the track, choosing their helmets carefully. Who's got the biggest head? We'll find out over the next few minutes. Excitement building here. There is Junior in the number 20 car. Rigo in number eight. Nathan has six. And they are racing We're with Anthro in the one car. And he was in pole. Can he keep hold of it? Rigo coming through the midfield. Back with Junior. He has some pace. And he is one of the fastest drivers on the circuit right now. There is Junior again. Rigo. He is right up against uh, his competitor, Junior. He's going to take Junior. He's putting so much pressure on him. Rigo again. Look at him race. Nobody even knew who he was before this. They're going to know who he is now. He's going to take his man brilliant by Rigo. He goes flying through and then through the chicane. There is Anthro. He's now down to fourth. Can you believe it? Not racing well at all this afternoon. Back with Nathan, the race leader. Rigo pushing him though all the way. He is the man that they call Rocky because he always uh, rocks the boat. But here he is, causing a storm. Rigo again. He nearly put his man into the wall, but he keeps on going. Brave driving. Junior just trying to be as cool as you like, but he's under real pressure. Uh, Nathan again, who is just giving up positions as we go through the race. This is really tight. Three cars bunched together going through. 
through the chicane again and they're going flying past Nathan what's happened there must be something wrong with his car Anthro struggling to keep up with Rigo and there is Rigo we're racing with Rigo who is the race leader oh he's crashed Rigo has crashed two cars go past him you can see him put his arm in the air he's not happy with that back with Junior putting pressure on the number 25 no one knows who's in that 25 car with the yellow helmet Entro number one he's putting pressure on 25 who's he going to take him Junior trying to go past 25 but 25 cuts him out good driving from the mystery man Rigo still battling he is one of the biggest battlers on this track Junior trying to catch him Nathan Nathan is up to third, he's past Anthro, Anthro dropping down the field, Rigo, look at his steering wheel, it's going up and down, he's trying to control it, that's the pace and the power of these go-karts. Rigo is strong but there is number 8 it is Rigo going past Anthro Junior is not giving up the ghost he's putting pressure on number 25 who is that guy? who is he? Anthro again now he can he just keep it together and keep riding they're coming to the end of the race number 25 is not happy and he gets a bump in the back for his trouble what a race Rigo was first Junior second how well did Junior do because he started third on the grid then it was Antro and then well we don't know who was uh, after that brilliant race here in California and it's all won by that man Rigo so the race is over Mr. First place right here the podium go ahead and then we got Mr. Second place Yep, Let's go. and then next up we got, wait, it's not him, Mr. Shit Talker, it is me. Oh! <laughs> you know what it is? Three is my favorite number, so it's only right. <laughs> nah, we had the same time, we are just up no, on it. Nah, hell no. That means, no. That means yeah. I'm off by a millisecond. Honestly, honestly, I had a lot of power cut off. Like the guy back there, same. he saw that I was killing it. And every time I applied brake, it killed three seconds, bro. I would have been first place, it is what it is. I almost had you. I got you right here, dog, on the shoeing. <laughs> Where's the champagne at, bro? Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Right, let's go. Yeah, let's go.